Okay, more on knots and whatnot. So, um, a barrel roll or a hyperloop knot. Uh, one interesting thing off the bat that I noticed, hadn't really thought of too much before, is the fact if I just catch this anywhere. Um, so, see here we have this type of knot. Um, it just looks like it crosses over to the other side, but if we spin it another half of a degree, then we have this knot which seems a lot easier to see. You know, one is just looped around the other. But it's interesting how the knot sort of changes the way it looks every half of a rotation. So once more, you know, you've got this twisted thing here. And then half rotation, and you have just the loops which go around one another. So, yeah, while that might be the same essence of twist that happens in a straitjacket, um, we can go, you know, right from a straitjacket place and pull our arms apart into a hyperloop kind of place, at least where the tangle happens at the tethers. So you can actually, you know, from a straitjacket, you don't have to be all up in your armpits. You can kind of bring the twist out to your wrists. And then there's a moment where you can pull the wrists apart into a hyperloop. And then you have a totally different knot that's got significantly more twists, or maybe one just extra twist around. And the same sort of thing where it'll change a little bit. Now I have a really weird looking knot if I do a half rotation, but then another half rotation again, you have just like a simple candy cane twist or whatever you want to call it. And then a half rotation again, you get this weird knot. So pretty bizarre how it kind of cycles through these two forms, just like a barrel roll will if you do a half a rotation. So just my two cents there, that's all.